Fuzz99. You probably don't recognize the name, but you probably recognize the person. If I showed you a picture of the person, you'd be like, oh, okay, it's that person. Okay, it's that individual from TikTok. So let me just go ahead and show you what I see right now. And this is Fuzz99. Uh, and for those of you who are still not in the loop, Fuzz99 is an individual on TikTok who does a lot of LGBT plus community kind of, you know, type posts. But here's the deal though, ladies and gentlemen, they have a personality uh, that even makes a, you know, a homosexual individual homophobic, okay? <laughs> They're just like taking down the, uh, you know, the pride flags. They're just like, I, I, I disavow everything, all right? It's that bad. Why do I call myself gay if my pronouns are he, they, and I'm dating a girl? Well, um, not true. You can see why so many people are uh, not a fan of this content. Uh, you know, safe to say that I am, as well, am not a fan of this content. But ladies and gentlemen, here's the deal though, I don't wanna, you know, be so negative in this video for a particular reason, because obviously there is a reason why I am making this video, not to roast Fuzz99, but to tell you that Fuzz99 is in trouble, okay? W what happened, Rogozin? Were they exposed for something? No, no, nothing like that. But rather, people on the internet taking things a little bit too far, okay? That is the usual, all right? We all know what happens when the, uh, you know, the incels, the uh, terminally online decide to take matters into their own hands, okay? And when that happens, we all know it's not a good thing. Uh, probably something evolving pipe bombs in your mail could be a thing yes maybe acid in your face who knows but as far as we are aware uh, as far as I'm aware uh, there is no definite answer like what what kind of threat uh, you know fuzz is dealing with but they're stepping away from TikTok because they're getting threats from people who do not like them. Are they going to leave TikTok forever? I I, I don't know. I mean, they didn't say, but this is the video that explains it all. Uh, we're just gonna show you a little tidbit here. I really hate to come on here to make this video, and I really don't want to because I know that a lot of you out there still really enjoy and like my videos, and they make your day, and they make you smile, and Cap. that's <laughs> all I've ever wanted in life. Unfortunately, this morning- Sorry, I know I said um, that I wasn't going to roast Fuzz through this entire video, but it's just a little comment, it's a little comment. It's just really weird to see uh, Fuzz talk like this, like a normal human being, right? Rather than like whatever the hell the other videos were, but it's just weird. It's, it's almost, dare I say, uncanny. I had a really bad incident with a hater and had to get the police involved. A lot of people in my life know my current situation right now, and I wish I could talk about it more, but I don't want to and can't really get into it. But I currently am being advised by the police to take a step back from TikTok. I have to take a break for a little while until a lot of this hate calms down. It might be a week, it might be a month, it might be a year, it might be forever. I truly don't know how long of a break that I'm going to take or have to take before I go though. But that's basically all the information we need to know from this video. Uh, they do go into, you know, allegations that are levied against them, but it's nothing like to like, oh wow, but it's whatever. Now you could say that this could probably be bait, you know, they're not actually being threatened, just more like harassed and you know, I'd say like, you know, that's kind of fair, but at the same time though, uh, I, w I wouldn't, I wouldn't say uh, that this individual deserves to be harassed, okay? Like, I wouldn't say that I hate them so much that uh, I, I wanna, like, burn down their house. I think that's insane for someone to even come up to that conclusion, okay? Like, they're not doing anything bad, okay? Like, the, oh, the only thing you could really say is that their content is cringe, okay? But yet, some people are like, it's so cringe, it must suffer. Like, what, what, are, you, what are you doing with your life? All right, like, what, what, what you doing? Like, who hurt you? Where's your father? Did, did he come back to get the milk? Like, did he ever come back? I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. This, this is uh, fatherless behavior. You might be saying, well, this content's fatherless behavior as well. Maybe, but at least this person 
isn't threatening other people. But at the same time, I do somewhat understand of the, you know, of the possibility that they could be lying. That, you know, the, the harassment isn't really that bad. But I've, I have seen plenty of people make videos about this individual. Uh, a lot on my timeline or my For You page on, on TikTok, so... It's not surprising. I wouldn't be surprised if this was actually true. Some of you might view this as a victory. I I don't care. All right. Like yes, they're fucking annoying, but I'm like I'm not gonna sit here and be like, oh, they're gone, yay! You know the the crab, you know the little crab video where it's like, oh, in, like this individual's gone. No, it's it's not gonna be one of those things. It's like I don't care. I like I really don't fucking care. It's just really sad to see stuff like this happen to individuals. Like, look, yeah, it's cringe, but let them do what they want to do. Okay, like as long as it's not hurting anyone, and obviously this kind of content isn't gonna hurt anyone. So it's like, whatever. Okay, so like, what, what what's the point? What's the fucking point of wasting your goddamn time with this individual, right? Like, you if you want to make some like snarky comment, then like, sure, fine, whatever. But like, threatening an individual for this kind of con, I don't know. Like, you're wasting your time. But yeah, that's basically the situation right there. Fuzz99 having to leave TikTok because things are getting a little bit too aggressive. Time to calm down, ladies and gentlemen. You're going too far. Let me know in the comment section down below what you guys thought about this video. And with all that being said, I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye for now.